everyone and welcome to Fun with Code. In this video, we are going to create a window which contains three, uh, which contains four buttons. And if we click on them, they move up, down, right, and left. So let's get started with our today's tutorial. If you like this video, please give this video an upvote and subscribe to my channel. I have created a simple window. Now let's start creating buttons. So let's type a command call button and let's create a variable called up btn which will be equal to button and this button should be inside root and the text is move down let's save this before we run the program let's create the button Now let's save the program and now you see a window with a button called move down. Let's create three more windows like this. Let's copy and paste the code. Now let's change the variable name. Mm. Now let's also change the text button text which will be left for the right button and right for the left button and up for the down button. Now let's run the program. Now you see all the buttons are present uh, at the same place. Now let's change the Row and rows and columns of the button let's change the column of up button which will be 1 and down button the row will be 2 and column is 1 left button should be at row 1 column 0 right button at column row 1 and column 2 now let's save the program now if you run the program you have four buttons you have four buttons but they did not do not look nice now we have created four buttons now let's add in some style to the buttons now let's import in tk enter as import ttk import ttk from tk enter now let's change the button to ttk dot button which will make the button look good now if you run the program now you see the buttons are a little bit good and they are flat now let's change the background color of the of the window Let's say root dot configure background is equal to background is equal to some hex code or you can say red, blue, white, something. Now let's run the program and now you see the background of the window is grey. Now let's change the background of the button and whenever we hover over the button it should change the color of the text now let's do that now let's create a variable btn 
अंडर स्कोर इक्वल टू इटके डॉस BPN style dot configure and then let's say this is the T button. T button refers to all the buttons in the program. Now, TK enter will check for all the buttons in the program and apply the same apply the same style to every button. background should be the same hex code we used copy the hex code and paste it now let's save the program and now let's run the program and now you see that the background is changed a little bit now whenever we hover over the button the, ba the text color should be changed and even the background now let's add in a map vpn style dot map this is the button background is equal to open square bracket and bracket and active comma let's change the background to blue or red now whenever let's run the program now whenever you hover over the button the background is changed to red the same way let's do with the text color now let's see foreground is equal to thank you and let's change the text to red now let's run the program and now you see even the text is changed to red color if you click any button they don't do anything because we have to give them commands to perform any task so let's make function so let's make a function called move and then we have we are checking if the text inside the button is move down then change it to move up note that we are not actually changing the position of the button we are just changing the text of the button so let's do that if up button dot c get and we want to check text is, is equal to move down then change the up button text we want to change it to move up also down button text move down now let's change this to text is equal to text is equal to now let's give this command in to move up button up button let's see if, if it works now let's run the program and now if i click the move if i click move down but move up button it changes to move up and the down button change to move down let's copy this code the each statement and paste it again change the up button to left btn 
left btn and right btn and the text if the text is move right and then change it to move left also the right button text should change to move right now let's give the let's give command to all the buttons the command is equal to move now let's run the program and see if it works now let's click the up button and you see that all the buttons change. So let's see why this why this thing. Because we we use elif if statement here. We have to use elif. And now if you run the program, everything works fine. Also, you notice that whenever you click at uh, the button again, you can't move the. Uh, I mean, you can't change the text of the button. So let's add another elif statement. Or let's just say we'll add an if statement here, uh, else statement here. Button dot configure text is equal to move from. Down button on figure text is equal to move up. Now let's copy this code, the whole function, and then let's paste the function and change the function from move to move left, and also change the name, the variables left button dot check is it should be move right into move left and move right this is left button and this is right button left right and now let's save the program also change the command for left and right button left left now if you save the program and run if you click the move up button you can change the text and even for move right and left button that's it for this video guys if you like this video please hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to my channel